Okay, so now we're going to go through how you're going to change your files from a PDF into JPEGs and how to delete the numbers from your pages. So first of all I've opened up Photoshop and over here is my PDF that was sent to my email after I scanned 10 of my cells. So what I'm going to do is select my PDF and in the finder I'm going to go to file open with and oops there we go Photoshop. Now this will take a moment but it will open up the files here and it's selected only one of the pages but I want all of the 10 pages in my PDF so I press select all and OK and then here in Photoshop so that's number 10 number 9, number 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and lucky last, 1. Okay. So this is my first page. And over here are many tools that you can choose. And what I'd like you to choose is this one here, which is the Rectangular Marquee Tool. Come over to your file, and where you've got your number, just oops, <laughs> okay. select the area to cover up your number, and delete. So this is a transparent area, but that's okay, because what we're going to do is come over to File, and save as and this is my first page so I'm going to change the name to 01 and the reason why I changed to 01 is because if you have a list of more than 10 which you will have it keeps all the numbers in sequential order um, now I want to save my files into this folder here, Mach 10 Anime, and that's come up automatically, so that was lucky, but if it doesn't, then change it to the folder that you want. Um, because I imported a PDF, the pages will save, or sorry, will open as a Photoshop file with the extension PSD, but what we need is a JPEG because JPEGs are what you can transfer over into iMovie in an easy way. So you want to change it to JPEG and save. Now mine's on maximum, which is great, but some of your computers have a default to medium or eight high. So just transfer it over to maximum and press OK. And what that will do is in your folder it will save, there we go, it will save your very first cell. If we come back into Photoshop, you'll notice that this image is still here. If we go to close it, it will come up with the option of saving because this image is actually from your PDF and it's the first page. And because it's the original, you don't want to save the changes. So press don't save. So then we're up to number two, and we do the same thing. Select the area around your number and delete. File, save as. This one is number two. The right folder. So we change to JPEG. Save. It's now defaulting to 12 max, so that's great. You just press OK. And again, we don't want to save the file. And then we're up to number three. So you keep doing that until all of your cells are done and stored in your folder. So 
Good luck with that. And if you have any questions, please email. Thank you.